This is News Channel 13, live at 5. You know, there's some great partnerships being forged in the area, but they don't all involve contracts and salaries. The ones we're talking about today are between students and volunteers who help them out. It's tonight's uh, Commit to Kids report in Lane Houston. Who else would do this story with a group on one special group of volunteers? Hi, Lane. Hi, John. Thank you for the build-up. <laughs> These volunteers donate their time at the Arbor Hill Community School, and modestly, most say they get more from the experience than they give. So what do you know about electricity? I know a lot. He's a SUNY researcher by profession, but to the kids in Mrs. McCormick's second grade class, Tom Stewart is Mr. Stewart, the guy who comes to their class once a week and brings batteries, motors, magic markers, and alligator clips and teaches them about electricity. Like using. You've been volunteering for six years. Six years here, yeah. Why do you do that? For fun. My kids are grown up, and I really like kids, and I need uh, to have contact with kids. So. The kids here are just great. It's just uh, basically fun for me. He's an invaluable person. He comes, uh, and he just he's just a very special person. It's the sentiment of many of the teachers here at Arbor Hill Community School, which has a unique partnership with about 30 volunteers. We push the focus on reading. However, we do have some volunteers whose expertise is in science or math and they try to incorporate that uh, depending on the student that they're working with. In fact, the areas of expertise are about as varied as the ages of the volunteers, from high school students to college students to retirees like Sister Aileen. <laughs> I could be resting, but I've taught school practically all of my life and I've always enjoyed it. I like children. I see that there's a need here. Phil said what? One by one they did Admit. Admit. Or Reverend Luther G. Godfrey, who volunteers five days a week, six hours a day. Do you think everybody should have a tutor? Yeah. Tell me why. So they can go up and be a good reader. Without a doubt, but each one of the students, I have nine of them, and I see a potential architect, a doctor, a astronaut, and I, I feel that they're going to grow to be very productive students, and that's my reward. And if you are interested in becoming a volunteer at Arbor Hill Community School, you can give them a call at 462-7165. And also, if you want to learn more about Commit to Kids, you can just log on to us and then mm -hmm. click on to Commit to Kids. It's a good point the guy makes, too, the gentleman, because just because your kids grow up doesn't mean you don't like kids anymore. Absolutely. You like being around them. They need all kinds of volunteers. Probably at all schools they need volunteers. Mm. So give the school in your nearest area a call. They can only say no, right? They probably won't. You're probably right. <laughs> Thanks, Elaine.